Hey guys, it's Shani, and I'm back today with another plan with me. And for this week's spread, I'm using this kit from Papershire, formerly known as Toffee Bananas. So that is why it says Toffee Bananas on all the sticker sheets. But um, I had this beautiful mini kit that is called Home that I picked up quite a while ago from her shop. Obviously, it was prior to the name change, which was like probably a year ago now. So um, I have had this kit for a while, but I used one of her like kits, like the leftovers that I had in a plan with me a few weeks ago, and I loved it so much. I loved playing around with it, and so I wanted to use another one. Um, and so I was like, okay, like this one has like I've had it for a while. I should probably just use it, and that's exactly what I decided to do. Um, I thought the quote box was also super cute, and it says, "You got this." Um, and again, I should mention this is a mini kit, so it's not like that full deluxe kit that I did use for the other plan with me. Um, uh, but I still had like pretty much everything I needed. There were a few things that I wish I had like more of or less of, but I think that kind of happens with like almost any kit you use. And I was able to pull in everything that I needed and I really like how the spread turned out. It's like my favorite things, like lots of white space and pinks and grays, neutrals. And I also decided to pull in rose gold foil for this spread, which I do love. So yeah, I started off with the bottom washi. I thought these were really cute and again, like so light and airy and really pretty. Um, and then I scattered my full boxes throughout and then now I'm just working on putting down the headers. So two of the headers that I used were from the kit, the today and the odds and ends one. And then I also pulled in these bow headers on a light pink background and those were in my shop a little while ago but are no longer available. And I also did want to mention that, um, speaking of my shop, I, <laughs> um, I'm having some new releases as well as a sale going up tomorrow on Labor Day. So make sure that you guys are checking out my Instagram tomorrow around noon because that's where I will be posting all the information with the sale code um, as well as where I'll be sharing like, you know, a video of the new releases like I like to do in my stories and so on and so forth, some more photos. Um, and if anything, you can always just like log into the website or not log in, go onto the website um, and everything will be there. And the website is planninglikeapro.co. Um, and then once I finished putting down these headers, I do move on to my sidebar and I struggled with this sidebar so much. Um, I feel like people get annoyed when like people are like putting down and picking up stickers um, like it doesn't personally annoy me, but I've spoken to a few planner friends that are always like, oh, like <laughs> this person just like moves around stickers so much. And then, um, I don't know. I just feel like if, if I'm not happy with it, I'm just going to keep moving it around, especially if the paper is like removable. Um, and this paper is pretty easy to work with, like, especially if it hasn't been down too long. So, um, I was playing around with a bunch of different things, especially since this was a format that I'm not used to like I haven't used a full kit from um, Paper Shire in a really long time so I like wasn't sure how I liked to do my sidebar and I also still feel like I'm kind of struggling with my sidebars in this planner I feel like I still haven't nailed down an exact like formula for what I like to put in it especially again because kits have such different um, options and like sizes for their boxes and stuff so I do still feel like I struggle in this planner with my sidebar, even though it has been like two months that I've been planning in it. So I'm not sure, but I kind of just put down some of my regular things with pretty much everything from the kit. But I did use these two headers or washi strips, and I think those were a leftover from Sadie stickers. And then I moved on to Monday, and the first thing that I marked down was that I was getting my hair done. Um, I was sharing this on Instagram as well, like on my stories, if you guys are curious what it looked like. I mean, I guess you can't really tell now because the story's down, but <laughs> if you're interested at all in my life, which I don't know, I'm sure not everyone is, but if you are, um, I do try to post on my stories every now and then. I'm not the best at it, but I do try. So to mark the hair appointment, I did use these two longer flags from the kit. And I also used this hair sticker, like, you know, hair appointment sticker, and that's from the GP studio. And then I had a really bad headache after, like, I was, like, nauseous and had a really bad headache. So I was, like, kind of sleeping a lot of the day once I got home. Um, it probably has to do with the fact that I, like, didn't drink any water 
uh, the whole time that I was there. I was like in my mask, so I didn't want to like take my mask on and off, but it was a really, really hot day. I had no water and like I had breakfast before I went to the appointment, but I somehow, I feel like as soon as I got to my appointment, I was like, oh my God, I'm still hungry. And the appointment was like five hours long. So I was just like sitting there like hungry. <laughs> um, but yeah, so my head was hurting and to mark that I used a scalp label from the kit and also these little uh, foiled eyelash stickers. I think those are from my newest addiction, like from a monthly kit, like leftover. It was in my leftover sticker book. That's why I'm not too sure. And then in the evening, Yanni and I did go on a little date night. We went to Montana's for dinner. And so I used one of these foiled wreath stickers from my shop, as well as an Ava, um, like kissing her boo on the cheek, which is like my favorite love these couple stickers and then on to Tuesday mark that it was payday like always I used the payday script from my shop as well as a flag from the kit and then I used one of these like squiggle dividers and those ones are actually going to be coming to the shop tomorrow um, so yeah going back to the new releases I have some foiled goodies coming like these squiggles and some half like floral mandalas that you've either seen me use or I do also use one of them in this kit or sorry in this spread I should say um, what else do I have coming I have like some quote overlays three kits if I haven't said that and then I also do have transparent dots coming so that's a little sneak for you guys you know the ones that are true and watch my videos <laughs> You, you guys are getting like, you know, you guys are getting the info ahead of time. Anyways, um, underneath that, I marked that I had an appointment with a dermatologist. I've been just like breaking out a lot more than usual. And so kind of wanted to talk to her and see if there was anything I can do. Um, and so to mark it, I just used a little thing from the kit with this face mask icon from the GP studio. And then I came home and worked on orders. I used a half box from the kit and another icon from the GP studio, these cute little printers that I have. And then in the evening, I was doing some cooking with my brother, which was really fun. Um, it was one of the HelloFresh meals that I had. Um, the one, what did we make? Oh, we made like fajita bowls, I think. And it was delicious. And I don't even know if he and I have ever cooked together, but it was really fun. So I marked that with a cooking icon that again was from my shop, but isn't available anymore. It's just like this little cookbook, which I thought was cute. And then Wednesday, I had to go get some blood work done, kind of like correlating to the dermatology appointment the day before. I had like scheduled a lot of my appointments for like this week. I was also supposed to get like a dental cleaning, but unfortunately my hygienist got COVID. And so thank God she told me and I didn't have my appointment because that would have been really rough. But anyways, yeah, I had a ton of appointments this week because um, I knew that I was going back to school in like two weeks. I mean, at this point, it's like a week. Um, and so I kind of wanted to get everything out of the way. But to mark getting the blood work, I used two flags from the kit and also um, a stethoscope icon that was from my shop. And then afterwards, on my way home, I went to the post office. And so I used another little thing with this envelope sticker from... Um, the GP studio, but I do end up switching it out for a different envelope sticker because there was actually one in the kit and I thought it matched a little bit better. And then later this day, my dad and I did go to Ikea because I wanted to get some new furniture for my office. Um, I was like redoing it and I'm loving how it's turning out. I pretty much I'll have like all the base of it down already like for my, you know, like the furniture and like the setup and everything. I just kind of want to like update some of the decor that I have in there. And like I got these cute frames and these prints and I have to like finish all that. And yeah, so we did that and I used a third box with these like shopping bag um, icon and that is from the GP studio again. I pulled in a bunch of her icons on this first half of the week. Um, and I also did use a mini bow on top of it and that's from my shop. And then Yanni came over in the evening and we were watching Money Heist. And so I used one of the TV bow icons that's from my shop as well. And then here I am. I thought I could initially just like peel up the sticker to change it. But um, I have it on the GP Studio, um, her like premium matte paper. It was actually an icon that I got from her advent calendar a few years ago. But it is on her premium matte paper, which... Um, is like not forgive, forgiving at all. Like if it's down, it's down, especially if it's on another sticker. So I did have to pull out the undo, but that's totally okay. 
And then for Thursday, I started at the bottom of the day because that was like the most exciting part of my day, I guess. Um, I did get some dinner with friends. We went to this place called Kinka Izakaya. And it's like this tapas, tapas? I don't know why I have such a hard time saying that word tapas place, tapas. I feel like I'm saying it wrong, but I don't know how else I would say it. Um, but there's just like a bunch of like Japanese food and you get like a bunch of little plates and share them all and it's delicious. I love that place. So to market, I used a half box as well as this like meal boat icon from my shop. And then uh, we had like a time limit for how long we could be at the restaurant. So we decided to go and get some boba afterwards. And for that, I used the little boba sticker from Pastel Papery. And I also used on top of the half box, I used another one of the swooshes that you guys will see come to the shop tomorrow. I did pull them in like a bunch throughout the spread. I just feel like they're so, so fun to like add to everything. I want to literally put them like 10 times a day, but I'm like, okay, like, like maybe we'll just keep it to one a day or, you know, one every other day. But I don't know. I just feel like they're like perfect um, when I don't want to add in like a ton of different like plans and want to take up a bit of room and add some foil. I just feel like they're really fun. So yeah. And then I moved on to the top of Thursday, uh, working backwards, like I said. Um, and I marked both of my videos on Thursday and Sunday. I didn't get to upload a video on Wednesday because again, I like wasn't home most of the day. Like I said, I was like getting blood work and the post office and Ikea. And then like, I was just like not home and I couldn't really get the video up. So I did post it on Thursday and to mark both of the videos, I did use a flag from the kit with a little bow that was a collab between Regina and I a while ago. And then also this day, um, my dad was helping me like set up my office. So we just like built the other desk and we're kind of trying to figure out how we wanted to lay everything out. And so I used a third box there as well as a planner icon that's from the kit. Um, again, I wasn't really sure what to use. Like I had this like office sticker from Crafts by Towie that I used in my EC spread, but it was from the I got an icon for that. So I really only had one of those icons, but I was like, it's from my office. I make stickers in my office for planners. And I don't know, I thought it kind of made sense. And we were also kind of planning the rest of the office out too. Um, I mean, I was really planning it and he was just like my sounding board there. <laughs> um, but yeah, we did that together. So that was pretty much everything for Thursday. And then Friday, this is one of the floral mandalas, half mandalas. I don't even know if this is a mandala, but it gives me that vibe. So that's why I've been calling it that. But um, I did place one of those ones. I do have mini ones and regular sized ones coming. So the one that I put down here on Friday is the regular one. So it does span the entire width of the day, whereas the mini ones um, don't. And then uh, on top of that, I did mark that I was working on orders. I used a like scallop sticker from the kit uh, that said, I think, bills on it or something. And then I also used this coffee cup icon from the kit and kind of layered that on top of one another. And I thought that was pretty cute. And then um, I did go to Walmart with my parents this day. So I used a quarter box and this grocery icon um, from the kit. And then one more of these squiggles because <laughs> uh, I love them, like I said. And then Mark, that Yanni and I, again, were watching Money Heist. And I used another one of the TV icons. And then on Saturday, I hung out with my planner bestie, Regina. Um, and we did go and get some Starbucks. I tried the pumpkin cream cold brew for the first time, which is so freaking good. I love it. Um, my only issue is that like I wish it was available in the summer um, because I don't love cold drinks in the fall. Like I always prefer like a warm drink. Um, but yeah, it was so good. And the day we went, it like still wasn't too cold. So it was perfect and delicious. And so to market, I did use another one of the wreath icons or sorry, wreath stickers from my shop as well as this um, pumpkin, like it's supposed to be a pumpkin spice latte, but you know, kind of the same idea. Um, and that is from the fall bow icons from my shop. And then Regina and I also picked up some Thai food and I marked that with a meal icon from the kit, which is like on this really light pink background. So it's a little hard to see. And then we were just um, like designing and hanging out at her place. So I used a half box with a laptop icon from my shop for that. 
And then Sunday, I pretty much just worked all day. And so I used a third box um, with an Ava, like sitting at her laptop on her desk, um, kind of just, you know, getting her work done. And then I already had that plane with me sticker, like I said, the flag with the bow to mark that. And then while I was working, like while I was doing computer work this day, I was like doing it from my bed and I was also watching Million Dollar Beach House because I saw Jana post about it on um, her Instagram stories and I feel like every show that she says she likes, I feel like I like it as well, especially like we love um, Selling Sunset, so I kind of thought it would have like a similar vibe and it did. I totally just like watched all the episodes that were on Netflix while I was working this day, so um, yeah. Jana, if you have any other recommendations, I will totally take them, please and thank you. Um, but that was pretty much it for this spread. Um, I hope you guys liked it. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. Love hearing from you guys. I always get so excited when you guys comment. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Oh, and don't forget about the new releases and the sale tomorrow. Okay. Bye guys. Thank you.